Hello again! In this part 3 of the video, I'll show you how I use the pose assets from MetaHumans into my CC4 character. When I was exporting the MetaHuman character to Blender, I also exported the animations of the main deformations that we need. In this case, we, uh, you will see in this list that I've exported the calf, clavicle, foot, hand, lower arm, thigh, upper arm, and so on these animations correspond to these areas here. So for example, in this case, we have the thigh left. These are the animations created for the metahumans. You can see that, that the bones are deforming and moving around, especially to try and keep the volume in these areas. And we're gonna use the same animations onto our own character. I've already prepared the blend file that has the animations, which is this one. So now I will append all these animations to my final character. And then we go to the action editor, then choose one and see how it works. Everything seems to be working okay. Let me choose another one, for example, the upper arm left upper arm okay the thighs yeah the next process will be a bit a bit time consuming so I'll pause the video and then I'll get back to you. That's that's because now I, I will want to go in to each of the animations and just and just fine tune them for my character. For example, I for example here I feel that it needs to be something like this just so that I could keep the volume as much as possible and so on and so forth. And I'll do that for the rest of the animations. See you in a bit. Okay, um, so I've done correcting these animations. I had a few issues to fix, especially in the thighs. I've, I've done my best to fix these areas here, these areas here. And I've done that to, to all of the other areas. And yeah, now the next part is to just export this to Unreal and configure the post driver from there. I'm gonna do that in a separate video, so I'll finish this one up for now. Thanks for watching, see you next time.